Are you planning your next career move? Go to NBCUnicareers.com or call the NBC job line for the latest openings at NBCLA and Telemundo 52. I'm guessing one thing you don't necessarily think about when you think about war or battles or being in Afghanistan or Iraq is a manicure or pedicure. But as Vicki Vargas tells us, one Army specialist has opened her own little nail salon in Afghanistan with a little help from a company in Anaheim. They are far from the comforts of home, working and fighting under conditions that just aren't, well, feminine. So what's a soldier to do when her hands look as worn as a battlefield? She calls in the beauty troops. We want to do whatever we can to support our troops. Army specialist Amy Feltson, who happens to be a licensed manicurist, sent an email asking for help. Her request to Young Nails was for a box of donated products. They more than obliged. When she said that this would just, this would really help us um, mentally, just to make us feel normal again, um, it, was, it was a huge honor to be able to, to, to contribute to that. The Anaheim Company boasts their Manny-Q nail gel wears longer than any polish-like product on the market, and it's fast. It hardens under an LED light in 30 seconds. It cures like kind of like a, uh, I would say like putting a, a bulletproof varnish on your nails. <laughs> The company is used to shipping overseas. 60% of its business is outside the United States. But the package to Afghanistan had to be approved by a sergeant in Oregon, then sent on a military cargo plane. When she received the product, her battalion was so excited, they actually lined up outside to get their nails done. They were so pumped. Specialist Feltson and the rest of the 1249th got a box filled with beauty products, all designed to make them feel like women, even in fatigues. You know, that feeling of, of feeling beautiful, I mean, there's nothing better in the world, huh? The company says its gel comes in 18 colors. They ship the soldiers a bottle of each. The folks at Young Nails still hoping to get some pictures of how those nails turned out. They haven't heard from the 1249 in a little while. Uh, apparently the women are a little busy fighting a war. In Anaheim, Vicki Vargas, NBC4, L.A. Very interesting. Now, if you've been watching The Voice, then you know that the action is heating up.